Talents with Brandon Elliott, the coach of the State Open champion, Talons. Congratulations, Brandon. Thank you. How does this feel uh, to be the, win your second State Open title? Um, it, I mean, it's phenomenal. This is what these boys have been training for, um, I mean, since the summer. And for some of them, they've been training literally for their you know, high school career to maybe have an opportunity to do something like this. Well, some have been training since middle school. Cause I remember them back in middle school, they, they won the state championship oh, middle school years true. ago. That is true. So you, you guys have developed a great tradition of running. Uh, you had five class titles in a row in the late 2000s. And now you just won your fourth class title in a row. So, you know, how does it feel to be the head of this, this program? Um, it's been really great. I mean, these kids work super hard day in and day out. Um, it's just a really special group of guys to be around. Um, it's not it's something I look forward to every day, coming to practice and work with these guys, you know, regardless of the seasons that we have that are not, you know, state open championship teams. These guys are, are great. What was your game plan coming into today's race? Um, we just wanted to keep our top five as tight as we possibly could. I mean, that was our team's strength. We didn't have the top end speed as some of these other guys out there on the course. We were sort of aware of that, and we felt that if we could keep it really tight, one through five, we would have a chance at it. You guys came in as a second seed. Obviously, Connor was had a faster time than you last week. When you saw your boys come across the line so far up in the front of the pack, what went through your head? Yeah, I mean, we knew that's what we would need in order to make it happen today. I mean, I was checking them out in a couple of different places on the course um, that I like to be at, and it looked good, you know, at those parts, and it looked like we had held on to do just enough by the time they got to the finish line as well. Did anybody surprise you today? Um, I don't know if they actually surprised me, but Jackson had a phenomenal race. He's a guy that over the years has really stepped up in a lot of big races for us. I mean, Alec, of course, being a top three finisher today, was huge, uh, but just the rest of the guys not not dropping out of that top five pack was the most important thing on the day. Well, that's awesome. Congratulations on your second state open title and the first of these boys. Hopefully you'll do well on the same course next weekend. We got New England's up here, so what's your game plan for New England? Do you guys have any, any New thoughts? New England's, we're just gonna you know go out there and do our best again. You know, that's the thing. There's gonna be a lot of great teams from around New England there, and we hope that we can uh, run a good race against those guys. Well, good luck next week. We'll be talking to you soon. Thank you. This is Brandon Elliott here, the coach of the Talon Eagles.